Good morning, my name is Josh Hall, and I'm the pastor here at Selmore. I have the honor and privilege of serving as Shirley's pastor, and uh, on behalf of the family, we want to thank all of you for being here this morning. I'd like to begin today by uh, reading Shirley's obituary. And actually, before we do that, let's just bow our heads and, and let's have a word of prayer together, and, and then we'll go forward. Father, we thank you for the beautiful morning that you have given us. We thank you for the gift of life. And Father, we thank you for the life of this dear lady whom we meet today to, to celebrate her and to remember her. Father, we pray that you would be glorified in this service today. I pray that this service would be a comfort to Shirley's friends and, and loved ones who are here today. You might just let them know that, that you're here and that you love them. We pray all these things in Jesus' name. Shirley McCudden, age 79, of Ozark, Missouri, passed away Friday, October 3rd, 2014, in Mercy Hospital. She was born July 15th of 1935 in Iowa City, Iowa, the daughter of Gerald and Nanda Ferran Schreiner. Shirley was part of the original group that implemented the Developmental Disability Act levy for the Christian County ballot. She was an original member of the Christian County SB 40 board, now called CC Links, where she served as president and treasurer. She remained an active member on the board until her death. Shirley helped to create the Christian County Enterprises Sheltered Workshop. And additionally, Shirley was one of four founding members of Nova Center of the Ozarks. She also served on their board as well. Shirley was instrumental in laying the groundwork for Crow Haven Apartments and served on the board. She was a trained pilot parent that later became the network and started respite programs in the area. Shirley was passionate to provide a class for those with autism and other special needs and worked with Ozark School District to develop the curriculum. Shirley is survived by her two daughters, Jennifer Hogan of Ozark and Renee Hogan of Nixa, brothers Greg Schreiner and wife Connie, George Schreiner and wife Sue, all of Sparta, Murray Schreiner and wife Kathy of Urbana, and Jim Fletcher of Ozark. Sisters Sue Craddock, Norma Eastridge, and husband Don, all of Ozark. Three stepdaughters, Kathy Wells and husband Mel, Ann Hollick and husband Kenny, and Sandra Pataki. Numerous nieces, nephews, other caring relatives, and many friends. I could see 